when we did the Ask Lee video, mm -hmm. um, we got a lot of questions, and, and one was from um, Dan Henderson. A lot of people asking about that picture with um, Tom Platts. Well, you're Tom Platt screaming in the background oh, while you're showing a huge tricep. Yes, I've never seen that picture pop up yeah. before. Yeah. I'd have had a dollar for every time that picture comes up online. Yeah. <laughs> so what was the, um, was it a stage photo shoot or just off the cuff? Or? No, off the cuff. I was just training. I think getting ready for one of the Ironman shows in California and Tom was there in the gym training and not sure who took the photo, but I was just posing down near the mirror and did that, and Tom was there, so Tom just did that silly, you know? Like, what the fuck? You know, Tom's always expressionive, and he's always sort of over the top with, you know, whatever, so yeah. It wasn't stage for a photo, it wasn't a photo shoot or anything, I was just training, and then you decided to go see how it was looking. So you don't know who took the, the shot? I think if it's in Golds, it would have been either Irvin Gelb or... Could have even been Artie Zeller or someone, because Artie Zeller was always walking around with his little camera, taking black and whites and stuff, so... Would have been one of them. Yep. Yeah, well it's a... Like a timeless... <laughs> Keeps popping yeah. up. <laughs> Between that and the transformation photo. <laughs> so yeah. The one where I'm overweight, then I diet down and get in shape, that one. And people say, is that really you, Walter? But considering it wasn't a staged photo shoot compared no. to all the photo shoots you've, you've done, mm -hmm. like I think... Um, yeah, I've always found that, like, Artie Zell, he took the one of the hands overhead leaning on the bar. It was the cover yeah. of Muscle and Fitness. Yeah. That wasn't a staged real photo shoot. It was just me training out there and took my shirt off the pose. And then I said, I'll just do a few triceps to pump up. And then I'll do a set and just rest, do a set and rest. And I just, I was resting, I just had my hands leaning yeah. on the bar and... So yeah, because Artie Zelly, a lot of his famous pictures of Arnold and them training at World Gym are just the ones where, just taking shots as they're just yeah. walking around training, chatting, whether it be Arnold talking to someone in the gym, Louie or somebody else, Ken Waller, you know, those sort of pictures are the ones you see in the magazine, yeah. so I think because it more relaxed and more natural. When you stay staging, sometimes it just looks staged, yeah. so. No, and then I remember once Artie and I tried to do that picture again, one time when we were actually doing a photo shoot and just never turned out the same so I didn't worry about it because yeah. then we are trying to do the same pose and that's like nah it's just, it's just natural before when yeah, you just did it and he goes click so yeah trying to stage it just never looked the same and um while we're down memory lane we'll talk about another great <laughs> while I can still remember <laughs> um, um what do you think of the new Dorian Yates film Inside the Shadow I haven't seen it I heard some people say it's okay and well, sometimes I'll see a clip of it, not a clip, but it might, might pop up on something. Maybe on Twitter or something, someone posts something and I see the name of it and stuff, but I've never watched it, so I haven't seen it at all. Some people say it's good. Speaking of new movies, though, I've heard um, there's been a lot of posts come up that I must I must be like psychic. Everyone's saying Generation Iron 2 is total shit worse than the first so oh really well, that's hard to believe <laughs> the first one was so bad it's hard to believe that this second one's worse but yeah some people say they only got 20 minutes into it and turned it off it's that bad. oh really <laughs> yeah so my prediction was right there's not not even anyone <sighs> falling off a horse on this one so that's more about the people who are in bodybuilding i guess and they sort of can make a living from the internet who aren't really nobodies like the Callums or you know, Rich, they're, they're somebodies, but yet it's not like, you know, back in the day, you yeah. were pro bodybuilders now, it's like anyone on the internet or YouTube or this or that can make money just from being nothing type thing, so. But I haven't seen it, but everyone that's commented on it just said it's the worst they've seen, so. Yeah. Just boring. I'm going to have to see it now just so I can give a good, G a critique. good comment. Yeah, yeah, please. <laughs> and did you spend a lot of time with Dorian, or? No, I never really... The only time I saw Dorian was maybe, at, like I said, at a contest here or there. So we never really big conversation, just quick chit chat in passing. So it was never, never one, never a big conversation with him at all. No. Well, I guess, you know, he was training on opposite sides of the, in the world. No. No. And then I said I competed with him at that 97 Olympia, which was his last Olympia. And then yeah. just backstage, just like, hi, how you going? Just yeah, general, yeah. general chit chat. No, never. 
Yeah, if I saw him at Expo, you know, it's been highly, I'd be like, hi, how you going? And that was it type thing, so, yeah, never really got into deep conversations. Someone said he's got a new organisation now too, like a new bodybuilding organisation. Started a new, like, federation type thing, so. Oh, that would be whoa. interesting. But, you know, I had the IFBB's uh, going places now and... Well, I think uh, it must be connected somehow because Dorian was always loyal to the IFBB, so I can't see it being where it was a branch off of that, don't know, but I did see the, it's got some, just a couple of initials for what it was, but they've got that new one in England now, the PCA and all that, so it's something similar, just a couple of initials like that, and I reckon it's going to be, I didn't, I didn't click on the link to see whether it's prize money or what it is, but I'll find it again and see, but yeah, someone said it sounded okay, but I don't know.